All right, throughout my lifetime, not just at Baldwin, I've had many people make a huge impact on my life. Without these people, I wouldn't be the person I am today. I would like to recognize those who have impacted me these last four years and thank them for what they've done for me. I would like to begin with my family, not just my parents, but also my grandparents, brother, and sisters. They have taught me how to be respectful to my peers as well as to never give up. With that love and support, I have been able to achieve many goals. Two goals stand out to be the most though. The first was that sophomore year, sitting in my brother's graduation ceremony. I saw a few students wearing a cool blue stole, and I thought in my head, I gotta work harder to wear one of those in my graduation night. Last semester, I received a letter in a big orange envelope asking me to apply to National Honor Society. Throughout the two weeks I put that long and annoying application together, it finally paid off. I get to wear that blue stool on my graduation night too. But not only am I proud of myself, but I am thankful for my parents for encouraging me and nagging me to always stay on top of my work. The other goal was making the playoffs this year for lacrosse. I'll be honest, at the beginning of the season, I doubted that goal would ever become true. But with the support of my parents every day to continue pushing myself through the conditioning as well as the season, it paid off. Just the other night, we beat Hampton on their home turf, 10-9, to 9, and it felt awesome. But <laughs> it has us moving on to the second round of playoffs. No Baldwin girls lacrosse team has made it this far until now. Feeding off of that, I want to thank my teammates. Without them making an impact on my life, I would not have played lacrosse all four years of high school. They have not only become my friends, but they have become my family away from home. I know I can count on them to always have my back, not only on the field, but off of it as well. We have taught each other how to work as a team and have helped each other to keep our cool when a ref makes a bad call, and it's very difficult. But throughout our season, we have worked together better than ever before, and now we have not only achieved our goal of playoffs, but we are moving on in the playoffs as well. <laughs> I would also like to give someone in this room a shout out, Mara. When I was a new girl at St. Elizabeth in third grade, she happened to be the first person I met outside of the rectory next to the church to be exact. I told you I was gonna cry. <laughs> From then until now, we've been best friends 10 long but fun years later. From all the stupid jokes to our dumb moments, we've had made men many memories together. I can't do this by Although we don't get to hang out as much as we used to, which was like every day, we still manage to keep our friendship strong and look back on the good old St. E's day. Hannah, Justin, wherever you are, if you're not here, <laughs> you guys understand. But Maura and I were shaking. Maura and I played every sport possible together. Basketball, volleyball, soccer, cross country, lacrosse. We even danced in the St. E's talent shows. <laughs> we call ourselves the Fab Five. Hannah, Mara, Mary Beckovac, Katie Bardis, and I. But aside from those memories, we always stuck together, and I thank you, Mara, for that. I'm happy to call her one of my best friends. <sighs> New friends come along with high school, too. People that I never thought I'd be friends with. People who I never actually knew would be as weird and as obnoxious as I am. People who used to be old sports rivals. St. Gabe's. We've learned to put that aside and made many memories together. But one of the things that high school has taught me over the years is that people come and go. Memories stay forever. The people that you meet in life have, have an impact on who we become. Some people walk in our lives for a reason, whether it's to make us a stronger person or to be our friend. They all shape who we will become. Good luck to all of you in the future, and I thank you all who've been a part of my life.